Hi, friends. You found me. Attention all units. Attention all units. <laughs> Today we're going to learn about fire rescue vehicles. Come on! Did you know there's all types of fire rescue vehicles? There are fire trucks, fire helicopters, fire planes, and even fire boats. Firefighters use them to put out fires to keep us safe. Let's learn about each one. I have a book here that has all different types of rescue vehicles. Let's check it out. Let's start with the fire truck. This is a fire engine. It's also called a pumper. The fire engine is usually the first one to arrive. So it needs to have water ready to be used. It pumps water from the tank to fight the fire. That means it has a big water tank on it. This is helpful for them when there's no fire hydrant nearby. Have you seen a fire hydrant? It's like a faucet for the firefighters. The firefighters use a special tool to open up the fire hydrant. Here, look, this is the fire hydrant and here's the wrench on top. And this is where the hose hooks up to it, right there. Fire hydrants come in many different colors, so the firefighters know which one has the strongest water pressure. Red is the weakest water pressure. Orange is a little bit stronger. After that, it's the green fire hydrant. And the strongest hydrant is blue. That's my favorite color. What color fire hydrant have you seen? Not all fire trucks have a water tank. Ladder trucks don't have a water tank, but they have a big ladder. See? Right here, look at this big ladder. That's why they're called ladder trucks. The ladder stretches out longer and longer to help fight fires in tall buildings. Have you ever seen a very long fire truck with two firemen in there driving it? These are called the hook and ladder trucks and they are the biggest fire trucks. The hook and ladder truck needs one person in the front driving and a second person in the back driving. So the truck can turn safely and easily. The hook and ladder truck also has a bucket on the end of the ladder. This is where the firemen stand. It also helps rescue the people. Our next truck is the boom truck. It has a bucket at the very end of the long boom. The boom is like a big arm that bends and it moves in different directions. And it goes really high. How about when there's a fire that can't be reached by the fire truck? Oh no, no roads. Don't worry, there are even fire rescue vehicles that can go off road. So they have big tires that can go over rocks and stuff. Cool, right? What about when fires can't be reached by all fire trucks? Ah! Don't worry, that's when you need to fight fires from the sky. Fire helicopters and fire airplanes can get the job done. Fire helicopters they have big buckets that scoop up water from oceans and lakes and drops down on the fire. Sometimes they get water from a swimming pool. Is that cool? Helitankers are fire helicopters that don't have a bucket. Instead, they carry water inside. They drop water directly from their water tank. Wow, direct hit! They also drop a special red liquid called fire retardant on areas around the fire to stop it from catching on fire. As for the fire plane, they have big tanks that drop water all over the fire. That's why they're called water bombers. The fire planes also drop fire retardant too. Some fire planes can go really low to scoop up water. What if the fire is not on land, but water? Hmm. Bring in the fire boats! Fire boats pump 
water directly from under them. The endless water supply from the ocean or lake, it shot up from the really powerful water cannon. Water cannons can shoot water really high. Look at that! They put up fires on boats or fires close to water. Sometimes fire boats team up with helicopters for air support to put out fires. There's always more than one firefighter to fight a fire. The captain tells the other firefighters what to do. The engineers stay by the truck to turn on the water. There are also the paramedics or the EMT. They help anyone that gets hurt. They are always there with the firefighters to help. People that are rescued from the fire or any other kind of emergency. When you hear sirens, get out of the way so a hero can come save the day. I have a rescue vehicle here. These are stabilizers, so when the big ladder goes up, it doesn't wobble around and fall over. These are what help them stand. Look, so it doesn't go like this. The stabilizers are there. And this is what they do when they're done with the fire. There's a fire, I'm coming to rescue! Woo, woo, woo! I'm here! I'm getting out! I see a cat! I rescued him! I'm gonna put out the fire! Yeah, go! That was awesome! Good job! There's no more water left in the, the pumper. We need reinforcements. We ran out of water. Air support, air support, come in. Yeah. We, we need more water, let's go. I'm on my way. take my mask off. That was great work, guys. Yay! Hooray! I wonder what it will be like to be a fireman and fight fires right now. You kids, do you want to go too? Uh -huh. Okay, I'm ready. Well, here you go. Whoa. Wow, I'm a fireman. This is so cool. I have a walkie talkie and a whistle. <whistles> and an ax. Can't, can't, can't. And I love my cool helmet. Wait, you'll need help. What should I do? You can't fight a fire on your own. Here's a buddy. Whoa, I'm here. Thank you, Super Nikki. Wow. You're welcome, Engineer Nikki. Hi, Hi Fire Engineer Nikki. Nikki. So are you guys ready for an adventure? Yes. yes. Well, have fun. Are you ready for an adventure too? Do you like it, friends? Oh no, we have an emergency call. Let's go, Andy Nikki. I got your back, Fireman Nikki. This is Fireman Nikki. I'm ready for your command. 
There's a structure fire on First and Bentley Street. We need you there as soon as possible. Copy that. We're on our way. Did you copy that, Engineer Nikki? Loud and clear, Fireman Nikki. First and Bentley Street. <laughs> out this fire. Copy that, Fireman Nikki. What's your location? We're on the corner of 1st and Bentley Street. Roger that. We're on our way.
about being a firefighter is fun, but it sure is hard work. You can say that again. I'm sure glad that's over. Now we can go back to the station and rest. Attention all units. We have a brush fire on 9th and Arlington. We need all units available. put out the fire, it was so cool. And that was so cool how you rescued that dog. I love the fire airplanes and the fire trucks, and I love the water cannons, and I love learning about the fire hydrants. What was your favorite part? That was my favorite part too. Remember, if there's any kind of emergency, call 911 or find a parent to help you call 911. And if you ever need an adventure, you know what to call. Super Nikki! Until